Welcome everyone, my name is Alie, and recently I went back to Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, the first ever Call of Duty to have supply drops introduced, and I started unlocking weapons that I'd never used on that game that were basically DLC weapons. We unlocked a lot of amazing weapons, using them for the very first time, discovering some amazing weapons, a few pretty terrible weapons to be honest with you guys. However, one weapon has eluded us since we started this series, and it eluded me for about 150 pounds until cheese 150 pounds I was sitting here opening up like a hundred supply drops until I came back to my console but you know what I'm gonna open up a few more opened up one not the cell three open up two and then BAM the cell three specifically the cell three phantom version finally finally came out for supply drop and I am here today guys to cover it for you guys as a weapon I have never at least I don't think, never made a video on here on this YouTube channel. So if we go into my gingerbread man's creator class, we can see the Cell 3 Phantom right here. It looks amazing. I mean, it is a great looking weapon regardless, but that black and orange coat for its paint, plus increased damage, can I just say, is absolutely fantastic. Now, unfortunately, I've got nothing left. Like, I literally haven't used it since unlocking it. I'm just going to check quickly if there's any DLC weapons. Ah, oh, the A4, I used that one. Age is going at first came out doesn't count the ohm again doesn't count i think unless there's some secondaries in here this is gonna be i'm actually really sad the last ever dlc weapon that i haven't used for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Oh man, I love doing these videos so much. But it's not going to finish quite yet because we've still got a play of it today. See just how good it is. Did we miss out on an amazing weapon. We're going to find out for the very first time here, my friends. Now, I want to give a big shout out to all the notification squad. All of you guys that have notifications turned on by hitting the bell just next to subscribe. You're getting a shout out right now. Bam, 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 bam. That is right, all of you guys, honestly, thank you so much. Turn it on, drop me a tweet, and you can be included within the next notification shout out in these videos. So there's nothing left for me to do apart from jump in the game. I have no more reason to spend a load of money on supply drops and advanced warfare, which is always a good thing. And if you're excited, smash that thumbs up button. Hopefully we get something amazing with this gun and it really is worth all the money we spent trying to unlock it. So let's do it guys, let's jump into some games. All right guys, a good first map for this weapon. We want a map that's small obviously. It is a shotgun and it's actually got some unique traits and I remember I not known this for ages when the weapon was a thing back in uh, Advanced Warfare's obviously prime time. Okay, first kill with it. Let's get out of there. So basically, rather than just tapping to fire each time, if you hold it down, I'll try and give an example. There you go. That is it shooting. And it's gonna get it got me killed, but you saw you saw how it worked, right? It can basically go semi-automatic or fully automatic after the first shot, which is very useful. So we're definitely gonna be giving that a go. Now, the thing is, I mean, it's a shotgun. Like, you can't escape that. Oh, my God. And actually, oh, that's a teammate. <laughs> it looks so badass when it's shooting, by the way. Absolutely amazing. But after that first shot, it is so slow. The lag between... No, 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 no. The lag between the shots is just not what you want. So I have to be so tactical while I was playing with this weapon, to be honest with you. Friendly UAV above. Okay, nice, nice, nice. I'm amazing I'm on any sort of streak. I don't know. I think for me, the worst weapon of this series is going back to Advanced Warfare. Oh, this guy is screwed, by the way. Yeah, what are you doing? It was definitely the M1 and the best, definitely the lever action. But you never know. This weapon... Oh my god, how'd they get away with that? You never know. Another weapon could overtake the lever action if this thing pops off. Where was I getting shot? I could not see him for the life of me. I, damn it, I was on a nice little street there as well. I could hear him. The gr ah, I didn't really take advantage of system hacks when Advanced Warfare was the main Call of Duty game. It's basically like sound whoring, and I should have used it so much more than I did. There's another one. Okay, cheeky little double kill. This is such... Until you're going automatic, this is not a very effective weapon. I don't know how... Like, shooting people from behind is how I'm getting kills right now. You ready for this? Oh, God. Oh, God, no. 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 No! I'm ready for them, but they've got a UAV now. Oh, God, I've got to run. I've got to run. I know I say this a lot, and any excuse for me to play free for I will take. But this definitely feels like a weapon that you want to be using in a mode where you're, you're being super, super sneaky and you've got a little bit more targets than... 
than just half the other team. I think this is a free fool kind of gun. Just saying. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Cheeky! <laughs> Okay, no one else in my team is pulling in these UAVs, so it's pretty much up to me, to be honest with you. Oh my god. I was, I was basically thinking that, you know what? I'm not using its fully automatic features anywhere near enough. I know there's a butt ton of enemies over there. I'm just going to run in and hold down the trigger. And I, I tried, I preempt it right there, but... It's this this weapon comes from exo zombies right guys and you know that if you played a lot of advanced warfare and it is it's a zombies weapon like hold it down get it into fully automatic mode against freaking things that don't really shoot back but but anything else now oh my god mr abel you are popping off my friend just get a quad feed i don't know what you just did but it was good a multiplayer uh, i don't know i don't know i'm hitting these guys head on you ready for this hey didn't expect that did ya Oh, what? I, I was sure he was above. He's... Wait, wait, what, what? That should be one of the biggest fail shots I have ever done on camera in Call of Duty ever. It's a little bit hot in this recording room. And my hands got a tad sweaty. They slipped on the aim. <laughs> this is my excuse. And I freaking... I missed him. A standing target. I missed him. Ali, what? What is... He, that poor guy. What's his name? Cynical something. He's like prestiged. How is he sitting in corners not moving? What are you doing, bro? Oh, oh, game winning kill cut. Okay, this is my first ever multiplayer game with the Cell 3. What am I saying so far? Bearing in mind, it can get attachments, but I genuinely don't think I went 25 and 9 for my first ever game. I genuinely don't think attachments are as issue. The issue is, I, I would change it from being automatic to being semi-automatic, where I can control how quick I shoot it. If, if that could happen, it would be great, but I don't think that's an option, unfortunately. Instead, you've got to roll with the punches and just pray that you don't hit mark on that first shot. And if you do, they don't like basically react quick enough for you to get that second shot off, because if they react quick enough, you're screwed. Before we find another game, guys, I have to make my character as elite as possible and despite the fact that this account was barely touched and barely any supplies was open opened on it until this series i have a ridiculous amount of royalty elite stuff for him i always tried to make my character as dark as possible in terms of the armor and the exo so it was not seen if i was jumping around the map i'm basically a purple slash pink flying target in this game now but hey at least i'm no longer gingerbread man and i can show off to everyone i've got royalty elite stuff having looked at this i think advanced rifling is always useful on shotguns and maybe quick draw could help as well but there's not much in the way to really help this gun out honestly okay yes jeez wheats i've actually found a biolab free fall game Bearing in mind, I struggle to find free fall games as it is on Advanced Warfare. Don't ask me why. It's always been the case. But the best map possible for this weapon. If I don't perform on this, if I don't win on this, I mean, it's tough because I'm not feeling the gun right now. But if I don't win on this, I will be sorely disappointed. Oh my god, look at the weapons they're using. So it's me and my cell three. One MP40 afterburner. Two. Oh wait, he's just switched it up. STG royalty, whatever. Another MP40 afterburner. A sniper of his... Oh my god, that samurai stuff is... Dope. I never got that, I don't think. Fair play. Another sniper. Dual wielding sniper. Another sniper. And another sniper. This is a sniper lobby, guys. Pray for Ali A. <laughs> okay, guys. This is it. The accuracy of my shotgun versus anyone running around with a sniper or the multiple people that are running around with those MP40s to see who is the best. Ooh, hold on. What are you doing? Okay. Good, 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 good. Easy first kill. We just want to run into the snipers. <gasps> None of the MP40 people. Oh, that is the first time we've had to use three shots to kill someone. Normally, it's been two maximum, which is not fill, not fill me with hope at all on any level, to be honest with you. And I don't even have a pistol as a sidearm. I literally just have a knife just to make things even harder for myself. <laughs> oh, no idea what he was doing, but... Is anyone else coming over here? No? Okay, fine. If you're not if you're not doing anything, I'm I'm rushing the center, because this is where I need to be. Oh my god. Hold on. No! There was a sniper in my sight. This is snipers versus moi. Shotgun user. Single shotgun user. 
Oh my god, he even got a shot off on me. Oh, I'm gonna have to start doing the whole automatic thing and just spraying like an absolute buffoon. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, nice. Got myself something I really did not want, but I'll take it. Nice. Oh, someone else is using... Ooh, the bulldog. I forgot about that. The good old bulldog from Infection. No! How is that not a triple feed? Oh my god, I've never seen a triple feed line up so easily. And his weapon could not capitalize on it. I mean, I got all three of them, so I can't complain about that. But they should have been, like, one-shot kills. They should not have been... Oh my god, okay. Chill, 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 chill. Enemy UAV. Friendly UAV. Ah, he's right there! Oh man, no, this is gonna be a close one, guys. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Some people. Oh my god, the snipers aren't bad either. But they're actually snipers that hit people. But this, literally, this room is the room you want to be in because they're trying to get feeds in there. I just want those easy close range kills. And as a result, it's just absolute madness. That was shocking. This is a better map than the last map for this gun, and it's not good. Now, one thing I always get called out on for doing with shotguns is not aiming down sight, because typically in a lot of Call of Duty games, they don't improve as weapons when you when you actually aim down sight. The spread doesn't change, because it is just a spread of bullets, basically, a shotgun. But typically, it doesn't help. That's why I do it, but maybe I should do it, to be honest with you guys. This is always the spot I keep on coming... Okay, nice. This is gonna have to be. I'm gonna have to pick my fight so carefully. <laughs> There's one. Oh my god, these snipers, the poor things, are getting the most heartbreaking hit markers in the world. I'd be crying if I was. I'd be raging if I was then, to be honest with you. Where's he gone? No, bad idea. Should not challenge. That I will take, though. Oh, baby. No! System hack. Take it. How? This gun is so bad. No, I... Shotgun on shotgun. And he wins because I even got the first shot. He can semi-automatic fire with that shotgun. It's so much better. Okay, that's that's good. That's good. Let's get back into this, boys. Let's get back into this. He's got such... I, I would choose the bulldog over this gun. Oh, man, it's going to be added to the pile of weapons that I'm not too keen on. If I can win, I'll like it a little bit more, though. Just saying. Just saying. Come on, work with me, Cell 3. Work with me. I'm giving you a chance here to do great things. I want you to do great things. You just got to cooperate. Oh. That ain't cooperating. That's getting hit by a freaking crossbow. Oh, my God. So freaking close. I love this. You know what? This is the bad thing to do, but just check this out. Look how nice this gun looks. This is where I get my thumbnails from, is looking up into that sky. I have to show you that, because it looks so freaking good. <gasps> no, I even span. No, freaking showing you the gun was the worst thing I've ever done in life. Shouldn't have showed you the gun. Should not have showed you the gun. This, this guy right here. This is how the weapon, if a weapon worked like this, Oh my god, who has got their microphone on? No, thank you. If the weapon worked like that, where it was semi-automatic, it would be so much better. And activating the fully auto, you, you, the, the gunfight's done. You either won or you lost. You haven't got time to put it in fully automatic, unfortunately. Oh, uh, I'm kind of disappointed. I am disappointed, I'm not even gonna lie. I was hoping this thing would be a little bit better. I cannot lie. It originated from Exo Zombies. Should probably stay in Exo Zombies, unfortunately. But as I said, that is the last, that is the last DLC weapon in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare that I had never used in any videos on this channel up until this point. There was nothing yet to cover. However, what I have done recently is go back onto my Xbox One account where I have ridiculous amounts of royalty elite 
and freaking stupidly rare weapons on there and I've been trying to do challenges with them and I think I'm gonna keep on doing that guys so if you want the fun to continue in Advanced Warfare, smash that thumbs up button and stay tuned as I try and make more challenges and use more awesome weapons, however, over on the Xbox rather than here on this PlayStation account. It has been fun. I've absolutely loved doing this and... I mean, I was going to say if any more weapons get added, it's just not going to happen, unfortunately. But I will definitely find myself more excuses to come back on this game at some point in the very near future. So guys, thank you for watching. I've had a load of fun doing this. Lever Action, you're number one. M1, you're at the bottom, you're last. And in between, there were a lot of great and ridiculous weapons that we found in Advanced Warfare. Thank you for watching. You guys are amazing. And I will see you soon in an Advanced Warfare video. I'm just not too sure when, so keep an eye out.